Hello fellow soon enthusiasts, my name is Christina and welcome to another Let's Get Reels movie review. Today is my segment I like to call What's on Netflix, where I tell you what you should check out on Netflix. Today's What's on Netflix review is a Netflix original movie called The Babysitter. I believe it was released in October or sometime in the fall of 2017. It is hilarious. It is so good. It's so different and it makes fun of a lot of different genres and I really really liked it. So here's your summary just to give you a little bit of an idea of what The Babysitter is about. It starts off with this kid Cole, he's 12 years old and he gets picked on a lot. He's a bit of a nerd. He has like the button down shirts tucked into his pants and you know he gets picked on a lot and he I think I think he wears glasses, yeah, I think, and um, his parents just treat him like a little baby. He's kind of upset because he's like the only 12 year old that he knows that still has a babysitter, unfortunately. So his parents go away and they leave him with his usual babysitter who is named B. B is really, really nice to Cole. He really likes seeing her because he, she's the only person that he feels he can talk to and really be himself and she doesn't judge Cole for being who he is. She just has a good time with him. He has a good time with her. They run around, they play games, they watch movies, they do all kinds of stuff. On the first night that B is babysitting Cole, he wants to try alcohol. He wants to know what it's like. So she um, gives him, I guess, like a little shot of something and uh, he doesn't want to drink it, but he doesn't want to seem like not cool around her. So he goes, oh, you're not drinking with me. So he dumps it out while she's going to get the drink and, um, and then he goes to bed or he appears to go to bed. Now his friend, his only friend that he has at school said, oh, you don't know what babysitters do after you go to bed. He sees B with a group of her friends. Uh, they are John, Max, Sonia, and another girl named Allison and they have this kid Samuel there who's a bit of a nerd he's like oh I'm the new guy in the group and uh, they're playing spin the bottle and all this stuff and then all of a sudden it just gets really violent and B goes up to Samuel and just goes <laughs> right in the head with these two like huge ass knives and they like take his blood and they're like you are a sacrifice and shit like that and Cole is like terrified he's like what the hell is going on and then the movie just gets like totally crazy and totally awesome I don't want to spoil anything else for you guys I loved the babysitter so much i really really did it was just so well acted so well done uh bella thorne plays allison in this movie and allison is the cheerleader in this and i don't think i've ever seen bella thorne in a movie if i have i don't really know who she is but i thought she was great she was so funny the girl who plays sonia in this movie is hannah may lee uh, she is in the pitch perfect movies she is the one who does not speak but somehow she wound up being in the bellas so funny and so freaking creepy like she totally creeped me the fuck out in this movie like from the moment she came on screen i was like damn girl is creepy as hell and she really really was she was kind of like sadistic and stuff like that oh my god totally nuts loved her too and like just the way the movie played out just the way everything happened and it was suspenseful it was silly it was funny and you're like oh my god this is absolutely crazy 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 good i did not know about the babysitter and i'm really glad that i came across it and the only reason i actually came across it and decided to watch it is because on the thumbnail on netflix king batch or Andrew Bachelor, as he is credited in this movie. He is a Viner um, and a YouTuber now. And uh, I see his videos sometimes on YouTube and sometimes on Instagram. And I was like, oh, King Batch, he's in a movie. I wanna check this out. I'm so glad I saw that. I'm so glad he was the thumbnail because that was my clickbait and I watched The Babysitter. He was good. He was only in it for a few minutes. and. I just, I'm so, so happy that I saw him as, as a thumbnail. Like I said, um, I really like The Babysitter and I really, really encourage you guys to go and watch this movie. It's so freaking funny and so good. Uh, it's got a lot of stereotypes. It's got a lot of like, you know, it 
just takes its influence from a lot of different genres and different movies and that's why I liked it so much. So that was my review of Netflix's original movie, The Babysitter. If you guys like this review in any way, please give it a thumbs up. If you have seen The Babysitter, leave your comments down below. I would love to know what you guys think of this movie, what are your thoughts, what you found funny, what scenes you found great or you know silly or whatever you want to talk about leave them in the comment and also in the comment if you have any suggestions of any movies or tv shows that i should watch on netflix leave them there and if i pick your movie or tv show and i watch it and i review it i'll give you a shout out and don't forget to hit that subscribe button for future let's get reels and what's on netflix reviews because that is what i like to do here and as always keep watching movies and stay absolutely fabulous